So females are hypergamous, which means they'll mate across and up hierarchies, uh, socioeconomic hierarchy, but competence hierarchy is really at the bottom of it. And so when you set up a situation where there's far more women than there are men in a given domain, say where mate selection can take place, most of the men still don't do very well because most of them are still rejected by women. But a small minority of men do extraordinarily well if you think well means unlimited sexual access. And so what's happening in the universities is that a small minority of men have sexual carte blanche in some sense. And most men are in the same position that most young men are always in, which is they're in a state where they're not particularly desirable to women. And then the women, of course, are terribly frustrated because the minority of men that they would really like to have long-term relationships with, it's, it's, a, it's a, a seller's market.